The world got to know a lot about the Doherty Institute on, on about Australia Day when they were the first to grow and share the coronavirus and uh, that spoke volumes about the capability uh, that the science and technology base we have here in Australia. Overnight successes take years and years and years to achieve as we all know and this was another example of that the investment in the facilities here through by the Commonwealth, the partnerships which Doherty enjoys uh, with other organisations, particularly um, the university here, Melbourne University, uh, as well as up at uh, Queensland and CSIRO and a number of other great research partners who are working in this area, really does put Australia at the leading edge. And one of the things we're announcing today is we're going to put $2 million through the Medical Research Future Fund. And we're going to be putting that money into a competitive program uh, for, to find a vaccine. Now, there are many research projects that are going on around the world to do this uh, very task. And Australia is going to play its part in, in that process. Already here at Doherty, there is much work going on in this area. And uh, we continue to support that work. And we want to get as many of the brightest and smartest minds in Australia working on this task. Uh, this is a task that's not only important for Australia, it's very important more broadly for our region as well, uh, which is very exposed and very vulnerable at this time. And so that is our focus, uh, working the science, working the problems, and putting the right measures in place to protect Australians, but looking to the future and using the best minds we have available in this area, and they're the best in the world.